Jewellery. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. The Prime Minister spoke for many of us when he took a call yesterday to congratulate President-elect Biden and Vice President-elect Harris on their emphatic win in the US presidential election. So does the Prime Minister now have any advice for his erstwhile best friend, President Trump, whose continuing refusal to accept the result is both embarrassing for him and dangerous for American democracy. Prime Minister. Well, uh, Mr Speaker, I had uh, and have a good relationship with the previous President. I, I, I do not resolve uh, from that. It is the duty of all British Prime Ministers to have a good relationship uh, with the White House. Uh, but I'm, I, I'm delighted uh, to find the many areas uh, in which uh, the, Biden, the incoming Biden-Harris uh, administration uh, is able to make common cause with us. In particular, uh, it was extremely exciting to talk to uh, President-elect Biden about uh, what he wants to do with the COP26 uh, summit uh, next year, Mr Speaker, in which, as you know, the UK is leading the world in driving down carbon emissions and tackling climate change. Chris Clarkson. 